Alright, listen up, people. Dr. Erskine has devised a way to turn a normal soldier into a super soldier. He's also found a way to turn a sandwich into a manwich, but we're at war, so we're gonna go with the first one. What? But I always ate the manwich. Our first volunteer is a man named Steve Rogers. My precious. Uh, that's not him. Oh, thank goodness. That's him. Uh, my precious desires to join the army. Doc, I think your next project should be to improve the CGI in this movie. Okay, but first. Let's see, defrost peas, pop popcorn, here we go. I can't believe it. My pants don't fit. Excellent. We now have the perfect soldier to entertain the troops in our USO tour. Wait, entertain the troops? Can I use my powers to actually fight in the war? How can I put this, son? That is the most ridiculous outfit I've ever seen. Actually, I'm Lady Gaga. That's Steve Rogers. Okay, I take that back. Steve, you'd be better off wearing this outfit. Whatever you say. And the award for best wartime kiss goes to... <laughs> that Lady Gaga never disappoints. Cap, your best friend Bucky has been captured by the Red Skull. You have two options. Rescue him with zero chance of survival. Or do the 2.30 show. And the award for best fat suit goes to... <laughs> I'll take the zero chance of survival. Maybe now I can change this ridiculous outfit. I thought you were going to change. I did. I drew on the little wingies. That's great. We know where Bucky is. Bucky! Lady Gaga? No, it's me, Steve. Wait, something's different. You get a haircut? Yes, and I'm the world's first super soldier. Correction, I am the world's first super soldier. Ew. Really? No one's impressed that I'm in a mask that looks like a real face? Ugh, who needs you? He's running to his plane full of bombs. Quick, grab that inexplicable zip line. me as long as this magic cube powers my technology. Ah! Why do I say these things out loud? This is Captain America. I've defeated the Red Skull. But since this plane has bombs in it and there's no place to land, I guess I have no choice but to crash it into the ice for 70 years. Actually, that's not true, Cap. You can easily land that. Goodbye, world. Hope this plane is a really long 